Welcome, today we will walk you through a practice problem on accumulated depreciation. Before we start, subscribe to our channel not to miss our new videos. Here is the financial data for the asset. The asset was acquired on the 1st of July, 2015. The purchase cost of the asset was $400,000. The estimated residual value, or salvage value, was $50,000. The company used the straight-line method for depreciation. The useful life of the asset was set at 6 years. The asset was sold on the 1st of August, 2018. Our task is to calculate the accumulated depreciation as of August 1, 2018, which is the asset sales date. We have four options to choose from, which you see on the screen. Let's find the solution. First, let's check how to calculate annual depreciation. Annual depreciation is determined using the formula cost minus residual value divided by useful life. This formula is used when straight line depreciation method is being applied. Let's make calculations. The cost of the asset was $400,000. Residual value was $50,000. Subtracting the residual value from the cost, we get $350,000. This amount is divided by the useful life of the asset, 6 years. Dividing by the useful life of 6 years, we arrive at an annual depreciation of $58,333. In order to calculate accumulated depreciation as of asset sales date, we need to know how long the asset was depreciated. Total time from the purchase of the asset date, which is July 1, 2015, till asset sales date, which is August 1, 2018, is 3 years and 1 month. In total, this is 37 months. This is the period the asset was used by the business, and depreciation has to be calculated for this period. To calculate depreciation for 37 months, which will be accumulated depreciation of the asset as of sales date, we take annual depreciation amount, which is $58,333, divide it by 12 months. This will give us monthly depreciation and multiply this amount by 37 months. Total accumulated depreciation as of asset sales date is $179,861. Therefore, the correct answer is option B. $179,861. This accurately reflects the total accumulated depreciation as of August 1, 2018, when the asset was sold. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel not to miss new videos.